How's it going guys? Welcome back to Figment. Last time we were playing there was some sort of glitch going on here where I couldn't insert the last two little s spokes. What the heck were they called? Valves into the tuba here. Uh, it was a known glitch. It was something that was happening rarely and they have it ironed out now so it should be working. But while I, I, while I was waiting on that I decided to run backwards to those two green batteries that were on the far like east side of all this next to the windmills and everything. The way that you get down to that remembery or whatever it's called down there why can't i remember what anything is called right now uh, i went and grabbed those so that i would have them for later presumably they'll be useful for another puzzle or something at some point seeing as it was kind of a one-time use beforehand you know they were only useful in the one place before so it, it, it would make sense if you could pick them up and apply them elsewhere as well nice breaking the endorphins just as I thought you were getting better at the name calling. Her name calling was kind of at an all-time high, and then that was that was a little weak. But she's just frustrated. Oh, dear bridge is back in tune. How fabulous! That's pretty funny to think of the bridge being in tune. It's, I like that. Fun. I'm glad I could help. Fulfillment slope. I must already be at the top because I feel so fulfilled having helped out that lady with her bridge. Oh, look at that. There's like a, a, a top hat and a symbol and stuff up here. It's also very colorful. I like the looks of Fulfillment Slope so far. It should be visually fulfilling and hopefully fulfilling in many other ways as well. Oh, can you smell it? The diarrhea dude is close. Oh, now you're just getting gross. Time to change the dirty laundry. I'm good, because her names are getting a little bit more disturbing. They're not sitting very well with me anymore. It's less entertaining and more more of a gross-out thing, Piper. I don't like this new gross-out version of things that you've chosen. You again? What the hell? Because <laughs> health is like bad in his eyes. You're trapped like a fart in an elevator, plague. Give it up. Never. It does seem pretty trapped. Will he sing a new song? Full of autism, hey? <laughs> I thought maybe it was just going to be a new verse of uh, his old song, but this might be a different song. Maybe it's the same song, it's hard for me to remember exactly. Alright, well, I was waiting to see if I could hit anything back at him, but... Oh, I gotta wait for him to... Get, you, you gotta you gotta poison these flowers over here. Oh, I, I do still have to hit it back at him. There we go. Oh, he was too clever that time. Hmm, what do I gotta do differently then? I thought maybe if I got him to hit this, then uh, it would break it apart. Yes, okay, that is what I needed him to do. I gotta, like, break up his cloud or something there. Grab the battery. Oh, shit. <laughs> Did I lob it all the way back? He is a fart face, isn't he? Okay, so now... Ah, now, now I get it. Alright, we gotta blow those loose. So that... Ah, the, the windmill blows away the, the big stink areas. No, I don't. I don't want one to hit at you. I just want. I just want a regular one of your regular fart canisters. Kill the flower. Sneak on by. Hmm. Oh crap! Ah, oh, do, doing it out of order. All right, I need the blue battery again here. All right, but do you guys do you guys see where I'm where I'm going with this here? I need to blow away the smoke so I can get to the the large flowers so I can make him hit them. So when when I once we do that, oh, there's so many steps to this. Oh no, that's there first is good I think. Once we do that, mind you, pull a lot of great ideas out of this game. Can't blame the plague for that one. Mind stop paying attention to a lot of things. Oh, that's sad. It is a pretty sharp looking hat though. I hope we take the the hat back. All right, once we get the clouds of smoke out of the way, which pick up the battery. This is the next step. Then we'll make him kill his own flower pads and then he won't have anywhere to dodge to. It's a it's a bit of a involved process here. There's a lot of steps to it, but if I can get him to throw one at me right next to me here, 
perfect. Oh, even that wasn't... Oh, good, it is taking out the large one as well there. I thought it was only taking out the small ones for a second. And hitting that back at him is not going to be worth it, because I have to... He has to get rid of these first as well. There, you've become your own undoing, stinky plague fart monster. Fart face, one might say. The music is still fun in the background, even when he... Wait a second. I didn't predict that. Now what do I do? Or is that... Will he, will he not be able to jump forward into it? He's starting to throw these a lot more, so it, the game must be aware that I've, like, near solving it. I don't need to space them out and make him, uh, throw them into the flowers or anything anymore. There, nowhere to jump to now. Damn it. Alright, there must be another step to this still. I got an idea of what that might be. Oh, crap. Guess I should have done this all at once when I had this before. I also just noticed there's a different snake tail heading down that way where he just dropped that bomb. So it's obviously another way that I need to head. Okay. Take me away. And now, ah, yes, the handle. But what exactly do I need to do there? Yeah, the hat machine works, but what is the hat machine? Fill it up with water. And next... Next is... Oh, okay, there. I, th I didn't think just hitting that twice would do the trick. So he hates water? For some reason, I don't know exactly why this guy hates water, but... Wait! Damn it all! Okay, this is... This is so much more complicated than I ever expected it to be. Good for this game. Good for this game coming up with a complex puzzle. You just have to make him take a step back. I thought we were going to do something to the back part of that or the front part of it or whatever to make it unusable from him from that point on. And then once he was relegated to either the front or the back there, it would be easy. To, then you would just, you know, have to hit one of those things back at him. Seems like I'm just washing him, giving him a bath, cleaning the stink off. Making him clean was all it took. But I don't know if it's just going to fix him or kill him. Yeah, it killed him. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to be quite so brutal, honestly. I thought it might have been a little bit more peaceful of a solution. Now all of a sudden that I have access to these, the game has to be a lot more careful of when a puzzle requires green batteries to solve, you know? If we wear it, can we get the power of the plague, Let's the power of farts? So I can get my scrapbook back. And save the mine! Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Well, I mean, getting the plague mask is one thing. I don't really know exactly what you're going to do with it. Okay. Here's the larger zoom out thing. Now I can see, you know, I've probably done everything in this green instrumental area and everything. There's, like, the main area with... Uh, the, the houses and all of that, where the, the main nightmare, the cool purple one, went zooming up that tube. And then there's like the clockwork steampunk one off to the side that I'll probably have to head to next. And there's like the starting area. Okay, so that was one entire larger area that I've now worked my way through. More comfortable journey going back. Yeah, no sneaky rad bastards this time. <gasps> we should take a trip back there together some other time. Let's get my scrapbook back before you start making holiday plans. I mean, maybe once it's not filled with nightmares and even other terrible things, you know? <laughs> my friend, this guy, he's back! So full of renewed energy and purpose. Uh, the thief. Mm, there's all the membranes that I've recovered, though. How many do I have? Like, five out of what? Like, 16? Oh, man, I didn't have anywhere near as many of these as I thought that I did. This guy has the coolest sound effects to go along with all of his stuff. Is it this thing up top here that I'm taking the mask to? I don't remember exactly where that needs to go to. Don't you see the absurdity of it all? <laughs> we'll render your every action meaningless. Enough philosophy. I will kick your face in. Seems like more or less the same rant you gave me before. More, more ramblings and ravings about meaninglessness and everything. I've shown you that I'm willing to stand up against you, you fiend. 
There's meaning and purpose in everything. Oh, reimburse the breath is basically is in die. What was he even doing down there that time? Why did he even bother coming down if he was just gonna run away again? Are you okay? A touching reunion. We've got the plague's mask. What do we do now? To fix what's broken and change the flow. Into the gate the mask must go. Is this the gate, the thing next to us here? Just, just chuck it in. Yeah, this is the gate. I don't know why giving one plague the other plague mask will help us. Yeah, there's just no reason for that. <laughs> it seems like we're just giving the purple plague, the red plagues, powers or something. Oh, that was a very temporary fix. Why did anyone think that it would? Beating another nightmare? You're kidding, right? Why do you have to like let go of your fears to go through the gate? I don't really know. Whatever. Nowhere to look, Mayor. I heard the hatching of cocoon. Kinda answered my own question, I think. You know, you gotta let go of your fears to to move forward. You can't let them hold you back. I did get to see that spider boss very briefly. Uh, before when I had still been playing the demo of the game and that's in the clockwork town the the steampunk area Which looked pretty cool. I'm excited to finally be moving on to the new area And I accidentally already saw just uh, just like two minutes ago where where that gear goes So I know directly where to head for that Simple just need to slap her right on this gear shaft on kind of the outside edge of town here Uh, yeah, let's go do like the very first part of Clockwork Town here. There's part of it kind of already exists in the series because of the way that some of those old demos had to be cut up, so it's not like it's entirely new. I don't need to tease it and put it off till like a next time thing. Let's go do the first opening sequence of the Clockwork Town. Clockwork Junction. Here we are. The mine's logical power center. Too much boring math here, if you ask me. Math yeah, isn't boring. Abilities were never really your thing. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, supposed okay. to be in your big Let's dummy piper. <laughs> hmm. They look like a little snoozy Zed of smoke coming out there, but I don't think that's actually what it was. Uh, nothing to see off this way. I think this is the only way I can actually go for now. Is that a spider web? Marg, it's creeping me out. Yeah, the spider is a little creepy. I mean, they made it kind of an adorable spider, but just by the nature of it being a spider, they made it it's automatically creepy. Oh my, white gooey stuff everywhere. Clockwork Town is doomed. Oh god. That sounds a lot worse. Don't say that. That sounds worse than just saying there's webs around. Orange battery socket. Oh, I didn't get to take... I didn't get to take all those green batteries and stuff with me. That stayed in the uh, that other area that I had been in before. Well, nerds. Blue battery socket. There we go. Perfect. Just gotta keep in mind that I need to look for an orange one too. Yes, now we get introduced to the big spider nightmare. An entire commonwealth? Gross. Then who are you? Pardon my manner. Allow me to introduce myself through song. Entourage. Wait, she's just attached to, like a rope and pulley. She's not actually even using a web, is she at all? Well, these guys are a little bit easy to wail on. Oh, he snuck past my incredible defenses. Now I can't seem to get him at all. Hit him into her. Nope. <laughs> just toss him way off the map, I guess. Ugh. Not while I'm sleeping. That's disgusting. I was hoping, I thought another one would be coming, and I was winding up to bash it away. Hey, creep! Come back so I can squash you. Disgusting. Oh, here it is. Hey, ah! Don't you worry, Piper. I can defend us. Oh, they recover if you don't kill them after you get them on their backs like that. They have a little bit of a timer on them. There. Now they're totally dealt with. 
collect my delicious endorphins, and then next time, I can go hunting down the spider nightmare. There's one other random episode in this, like episode 3 or 5 or something, where there's like a small little glimpse at the clockwork town. Very similar part of the game, I didn't make it any further than this before. So this is entirely new to me in the game. Everything in clockwork town I haven't done before. So that'll be cool for me, hopefully cool for you. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon.